I'm glad that you are on the right platform if you are willing to go solar. Uh, now in this video, I'll be telling you what points you need to consider while going to install a solar power project. Now generally, there are four basic aspects that you need to consider. The first aspect is the type of panels that you are going to use. The second aspect is the type of inverter. The third is the BOS, which is also known as the balance of system, in, uh, which includes your structure, wires and cables, the protective devices, the type of earthing, etc. And the last and the most important aspect is from whom are you going to install the solar project? That is the EPC company. I will brief you about each and every aspect in detail. Coming to our first aspect, uh, which is the type of modules you are going to use. Now, if you have a space constraint, then you can go for the monocrystalline modules. You can get a desired output in lesser space. You require almost 30 to 35 uh, percent less space to get the same output that you are uh, getting with regular panels. Now, if you have a budget limitation, then you can go for polycrystalline modules. You get the same output that you are uh, getting in the monocrystal modules, only the space required is larger than that of it. Now, if you have uh, your terrace surrounded with buildings and trees, uh, that is there is shadow on your terrace. Uh, so, you can go for the per technology. In this technology, you get uh, the desired output even if there is shadow on your terrace. Uh, that is, uh, the sunlight is diffused, you get uh, a good output. Coming to our second aspect, uh, which kind of inverter you need to use. Now, if you go for any make of the inverter, uh, which is Polycap, Havels, uh, SMA, ABB, uh, SolarEdge or any kind of inverter, the efficiency of the inverter is going to be 98 to 99 percent. So, the only thing you need to consider is which inverter is compatible with the uh, locality of your grid. Uh, many people living in Maharashtra will be knowing this, uh, that the fluctuations in voltage in Maharashtra are very much. Uh, now, the single phase voltage is 240, but many times the voltage drops below 150. Uh, that time uh, you must make sure that your inverter is in running condition. The second thing you need to consider is uh, which company is providing you the best service. If there is any kind of problem with the inverter, uh, you must look for the company which is providing you the best service. Now the third aspect is the BUS, that is the balance of system uh, which I earlier told you, uh, which includes the structure, uh, the wires and cables, the protective devices, uh, the meters and the type of working in it. Uh, now while uh, going for the structure you need to see what kind of material is uh, uh, they are going to use is it going to be the ms the gi or aluminium yeah, if you are going for gi uh, what is the microns on it uh, is it one time is it 120 microns or is it uh, 80 microns if you are going for solar parking or array structure then what is uh, the sturdiness of the structure uh, is it going to support the wind pressure uh, at the desired height uh, for the project or not so these are the things you need to consider. Uh, moving to our fourth, which is our last and most important aspect from whom are you going to install the solar power project. Now why this aspect is important? Uh, now I have seen a customer who have installed a solar power plant about 3 to 4 years ago. Now he used the best panel in the world and best, in, uh, best uh, inverter in the world. Uh, but even after installing uh, this system, he was happy with it as he was getting zero uh, electricity bill but after visiting the plant over there I got to know that he was getting only 3 to 3.5 units per day now uh, after changing some uh, uh, some string connection it, after changing some settings in the inverter now today he is getting an output of 4 to 4.5 units per day now if he would have considered a proper EPC uh, 4 years back uh, the project cost would, would have gone about 20 to 25 percent less. If the project cost was 10 lakh rupees, uh, he would have saved uh, 2 lakh rupees instead of going for 20 percent extra project cost. Uh, so this is the thing you need to consider. Uh, at Flare Solar PV Systems, we provide you a solution under a single roof in which we can free of cost solar consultation, uh, which includes your project ROI, uh, what is our, what type of modules and what type of structure and uh, what kind of inverters you need to use uh, we provide you the 3d uh, 3d designs for it uh, now if you are installing a solar power plant for your house uh, you need to know is it uh, going to look uh, good or not many times what happened uh, the bungalow that you are living in is of uh, 1.5 uh, 1 to 2 cr and the project uh, the solar power plant uh, installed over your rooftop looks like a factory so that is uh, not of any use. Uh, so these are the things that you need to consider. I have given you a link, a link below. Uh, for getting the free consultation from Flare Solar View Systems, you can go for it.
Thank you.